When's it a bad time for Shinobi? It's a trick question. Never! Welcome to a super special classic game room. Turn up the volume because this is the review of the FM sound unit on your Sega Mark III! Did you know that many of your favorite Sega Mark III and Master System games have hidden soundtracks that can be unlocked with the FM sound unit? Thunderblade before sound unit, Thunderblade after. Yes, this miraculous add-on is like the Sega 32X for your ears, except it doesn't play Cosmic Carnage because that game sounds good enough as it is. So you've got a Sega Mark III, congratulations, because that's basically the Japanese Sega Master System with a monstrous collection of incredible 8-bit games. Like a Lest, and if we look closely at the box, you'll see it says FM, that doesn't mean it picks up the radio. That means it's compatible with the FM sound unit. A handy device that doesn't look like much, but delivers incredible enhanced sound right to your ears. Proving that once again, Sega does what Nintendo don't. They make ridiculous add-ons that have character. The FM70 is a lightweight peripheral that just hooks onto the vents on top of your Sega Mark III and works in a similar way to the Sega 32X, except it does not require an additional power supply. You feed it the output from your Mark III and send the signal to your television and stereo from the FM sound unit. While it doesn't work with all games, it works with a lot of them and you can find the list over at SegaRetro.org. As it turns out, I have a bunch of these games including Aleste, Shinobi, Thunderblade, and Fantasy Zone 2. Let's sit down and enjoy. I'm gonna save Bob over here. Yeah! Bob owes me 20 bucks, which I'm going to spend on Sega Master System games. This is one of the best examples of FM sound unit improvement, Fantasy Zone 2. While it's still in mono, I find that the FM sound unit delivers a smoother sound with warmer synth effects, deeper bass, and the drum effects are terrific. It's a lot of fun to do back and forth comparisons like Opa Opa here without the sound unit and Opa Opa with. But wait, there's more. You can also get the Sega Master System to Mark III Converter, which allows you to unlock the hidden music contained within many of your Western Sega Master System games when played on the Mark III. It's... it's incredible! Rastan does what Rastan doesn't do. Some games definitely sound better than others, and while I can't give you a complete accurate list of what works and what doesn't, this is a super cool peripheral to own for all serious fans of Sega, and I love collecting for the Mark III. 
but there's a vast array of fun games to collect for it, most of which won't break the bank. Now, as you might expect, I've got a classic game room shout out and thank you to send to Chris from Jersey City. New Jersey! Thank you, Chris, for sending the FM Sound Unit Master System to Mark III Converter and Thunderblade to the show. Sadly, I don't have good working 3D glasses to play this one, but it does sound good. It's Blade Eagle 3D. <laughs> Only I could see in three dimensions! Try formation without. Try formation with the Sega FM Sound Unit! This review has been brought to you by Lord Carnage and the best of Classic Game Room. Buy your games and accessories through ClassicGameRoom.com. Welcome to the club, it's the Lord Carnage Club, where I thank these backers on Patreon by shouting their name in a volcano from Within the Zone of Danger! Jeff Breyer! Jeff Breyer! Derek Langley! Derek Langley! Michael and Ariana Nelson! Michael and Ariana Nelson! Michael Fernandez! Who's not named Michael Fernandez? Aren't Michael Fernandez? <laughs> Steven Chucknick. Steven Chucknick. Al Stiver. Al Stiver. Rick DeBarros. Rick DeBarros. Jason Goy. Jason Goy. Sergio Matthias Hergert. <laughs> Chip Sink Bell. Chip Sink Bell. Busy Signal. Still busy. Sean Zoltek. Sean Zoltek. Philip Straubenmuller. Phil does the dance of safety in the zone of danger. Jack Stavris. Jack Stavris. Oh, hot cunning. <laughs> 